what happens when you're walking around and they this die. augmented reality world and you actually come across Keith David? Uh, well, that's the thing. Like, so that would be an Easter egg, obviously. And, <laughs> and he you're would... just friends with him. Does it flip so, the game out? So whoever's publishing this is going to spend the money on this part. They're going to take any actors that were in the original film and they're going to pay them a lot of money so that anytime they run into somebody that's actually playing the game, they have to get in character immediately. And they have to like on the spot, and they are carrying a pistol, and they are shooting some aliens in the face. And they have the sunglasses in their pockets. They have to wear shirts with front pockets all at all times. And they have the gla- sunglasses in there. They pull them out, and they throw them on, and they're like, over there! And then the game knows, because it, this is really yeah. advanced technology, um, and... Uh, and so if this is a Vita in your pocket, by the way, hooked up to the Oculus Rift. Oh. And so because it, it's powerful enough to do this, and <laughs> then and they so they see you see the people you know the aliens and you're both shooting at them with you know uh, well, they're fake guns obviously but they look real and and all the the people that are not aliens obviously they're freaking out and running away but that's real and that's and, for, that's real so there's no processing power needs to be taken up with that. See, yeah. I'm thinking about the technical details too, and that. But the aliens you shoot, in in the in the headset that looks uh-huh. like you killed them and they died and they were like, aliens, obey. And then, the, uh, <laughs> and then, but but the actual real people ran away, but they're like erased out of the video game part, so you don't see them running uh, away from the crazy people with plastic guns and you know and celebrities. <laughs> I just like the possibility of a future where actors sign contracts with augmented reality games and mm-hmm. they have to <laughs> at any point mm-hmm. if they come across the one playing the game they have to jump into character yes yeah. that um and then i'm waiting for like mel gibson to, to like use that excuse in court for when he finally <laughs> <laughs> breaks the law or does something over the top but what happens if there's multiple um, augmented reality games going on, and so when an actor sees you with an Oculus Rift, and they just uh, assume that it's your, it's their game that you're playing, I mean, how are we going to prevent that from happening? <gasps> Why would anybody oh. with a <laughs> Oculus Rift be playing any other game but this? You're an idiot. If Sorry if, if it ruined your experience, but... What if, I mean... <laughs> what if you have... Mel Gibson's what, in two games. What if Mel yeah. Gibson? What if Mel Gibson's in two games? <laughs> what if What if Mel Gibson's in the Cowboy game? The Cowboy game's an Oculus Rift game, and so you got somebody who and looks if, like they're building a ramp, but they could be wielding a gun. You don't know, and Mel Gibson just blows his mind. He has no idea what's happening. I mean, what if What if you're playing the Mad Max Oculus Rift game, and then all of a sudden switch to the What Women Want Oculus? Which Rift which, game. Ar- which augmented reality do you exist in? <laughs> <laughs> 